One of the things that's come up in discussions about Friends over the years is uh, learning lines is, yeah. is not that's something... That's kind of like theater. Yeah, but you don't, you're not that keen on learning lines. Oh, you're right. Um, <laughs> <laughs> you get to do it again if you don't know your lines. But yes, I, I didn't always have an easy time remembering my lines on Friends. So you would not, well, I suppose cheat. Is it cheated? Kind of. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so where would you put your lines? Well, okay, so the writers would sometimes give you new scripts right on the spot or right before, and sometimes I also didn't prepare as much as I should have. So <laughs> I would, um, like, put the, uh, my lines either in the fruit bowl sometimes, sometimes in the sink. I would just be sitting there, and then you'd go to the sink and pretend to wash and look a couple of pages in. <laughs> and, um, yeah. One time in particular, I had something large to say. It was like a, I would call it like a paragraph, and I, or like a two-incher. Um, that sounds weird. Uh, <laughs> anyway, yes, and Matt LeBlanc didn't tell me, obviously. It was a prank on me, and he took my, I didn't know it at all. And he took the piece of paper that I had in the fruit bowl, and I was like getting an apple. <laughs> <laughs> and, and I just, I... I don't, do you say wung it, winged it, whatever the word is? I did, and it, I think it worked out, but it was not okay. <laughs> but did he confess? Yeah, on the Friends reunion. Well, not till that. then. That's when I learned it. Wow, that's mm -hmm. a long time to keep that secret. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs>